Hello friends and welcome to Coffee and Conversation. Encouragement for today. Rays of Hope coming from the Gordon Avenue Baptist Church in Adel, Georgia. Let me invite you today to pick up your copy of God's Holy and Precious Word. Turn with me to Genesis, the book of Genesis, chapter number 6. And today I want us to look at verse 22 as our text verse of Scripture. Now notice what the Bible says in Genesis 6, 22. Thus did Noah, according to all that God commanded him, so did he. And I pray that God would add his wonderful blessings to the reading of his holy word on this beautiful day. Friend, today I want to bring to you a devotional thought titled, Salvation Through Trust. Get that good fresh cup of hot coffee. Let's sit together, have an encounter with God and His precious Word on this beautiful day. My goodness. Friend, there's just not a better way to start a brand new day than a good fresh cup of hot coffee and a fresh word from Almighty God. Salvation through trust. You know, one day God spoke to Noah about the wickedness of the human race. The actions of men and women grieved him to the heart. God said that he intended to send a flood that would destroy mankind. And he told Noah to build an ark to save his household and the animals. The Bible said that Noah believed God. Now Noah had never seen the flood. He had never been in a 40-day rain. He had no weather map, no satellite program, or no meteorologist to tell him that a big storm was coming. All he had to go on was the Word of God. But when the flood came, Noah was spared and saved with his family, and the rest of the generation was swept away. Noah was saved because he put his trust completely in Almighty God. The days of Noah are returning to this old earth, and a catastrophic event will take place soon. And those who refuse to enter the ark of salvation, which is Jesus Christ, will suffer tremendously. Are you living in that ark of safety? If not, come to Christ today, because one day soon he's going to return and the rapture is going to take place. There'll be two in the field, one taken and one left behind. Will you be the one left behind? Or will you be the one who will walk into eternity with the Lord Jesus Christ? Friend, get to know Him personally today. Place your trust in Him. Let salvation enter your life. Salvation through trust. Trust in the Lord Jesus Christ. Think about that. Pray with me. Father, we thank you for this powerful devotion that reminds us that salvation comes through our trust in Christ. Help us, Lord, to look to him, the author and finisher of our faith. And we'll give you praise for it all in Jesus' precious name. Amen and amen. Well, praise the Lord, my friend. I pray the devotion's been a blessing to you today. And... Uh, Trust the Lord with all your heart. Lean not to your own understanding and be blessed. Have a wonderful day in Christ today.